This is Chief Monroe. If you want Julius back, listen to what I've got to say. Now that stunt you pulled downtown with a rocket launcher cost my associates and I quite a bit of money. Now I may not be an honest man, but I'm a fair one. So rather than turn Saints Row into a parking lot, I'm gonna let you work off what you owe me. There's a mayoral campaign going on, and I want one of the candidates taken off the ballot. Marshal Winslow is in his campaign bus right now, and he has an appointment with the northbound. Park that bus on the train tracks tonight, or you'll find Julius' body floating in the river tomorrow. Don't disappoint me. Julius is counting on you. Julius back, listen to what I've got to say. Now that stunt you pulled downtown with a rocket launcher cost my associates and I quite a bit of money. Now, I may not be an honest man, but I'm a fair one. So rather than turn Saints Row into a parking lot, I'm gonna let you work off what you owe me. There's a mayoral campaign going on, and I want one of the candidates taken off the ballot. Marshal Winslow is in his campaign bus right now, and he has an appointment with the northbound. Park that bus on the train tracks tonight, or you'll find Julius' body floating in the river tomorrow. Don't disappoint me. Julius is counting on you. It's not too late to walk away from this. myself Ugh. it didn't have to be this way
Did you handle it? Where the fuck is Julius? Have you heard back from Monroe? Nice work. But I don't think I can let Julius go until you do a little more community service. We'll be in touch. Looks like we wait. Why? So we can let this jag off jerk us around? Fuck that! And what would you rather do? You know exactly what I'd like to do. Johnny, we're not blowing up City Hall. Hey, I'm just saying, it would solve a lot of problems. What if they're keeping Julius there? Alright, but there's gotta be a better plan than let's be Monroe's bitches. You're right, there is. Marshal Winslow was a major public figure. And you can bet your ass that people would ask questions if the chief of police wasn't at his funeral. I say we hit Monroe during a funeral procession. That's to show whoever he's working with that we're not fucking around. You're saying we should assassinate the chief of police while he's at the funeral of the guy we just smashed? Yeah. <laughs> Don't tease me, Dex. Let's fucking do it. All right, let's get going. Johnny's gonna meet us there. we hit Monroe, we better get out of there quick. The last thing we want is to make a big scene. Watch your driving, buddy! Johnny's set up across the street. He'll be giving us cover if things go bad after the hit. Now let's get to the roof before the mourners roll by. Take this. When the funeral procession comes into view, take out Monroe. He'll be the one in the cop car. Okay, here comes the procession. Just line up with the cop car and... Ah, shit, there's more than one. All right, this ain't a problem. It'll just take a little more work to find out what car is in.
of all your sins. They'll be scooping Monroe up for weeks. Hello there, young man. This is Alderman Hughes. That was quite a message you sent at Winslow's funeral. And trust me, I heard it loud and clear. Now, I'd like to set one thing straight. It was Monroe's plan to strong-arm the Saints. Personally, I've always thought you and I could have a much healthier relationship. Now, we've had a rocky start, yes, but why don't we fix that? Come over to my fundraiser tonight. Julius will be there, and between the three of us, I'm sure we can work something out. Your guest is here, Mr. Yos. Thanks, Stephen. If you don't mind, could you wait outside? I'm Richard Hughes. It is a pleasure to meet the man who handed me the election. No need to be modest, I'm serious. There's no way I could have beaten Marshal Winslow. God rest his soul. But you made the impossible happen, and for that, I can't thank you enough. I mean, had Winslow been the only person killed, attention would have definitely been cast on me. But after that fireworks display you pulled at his funeral, it's become abundantly clear these horrible crimes were perpetrated by the Third Street Saints. While before people criticized my Saints Row urban renewal plan, it is now being lauded. See, until you came along, I was displacing poor people. Now, I'm destroying a hotbed of gang activity. What can I say? The public is fickle. Champagne. Oh, as you get older, you quickly learn that there are only two types of people in this world. Race, money, gender, none of this matters. At the end of the day, you're either a winner or a loser. Now, the sad truth about our situation is that in order for me to be a winner, I have to level your neighborhood and salt the earth. Hold on for a moment. Stephen, could you come in here? Where was I? Oh yes, salting the earth. Now I suppose I could try to pay you off, but really, what's the point? You just say no, or in your case, stand there looking intimidating and we'd be right back to where we started. So I figured I'd cut the middle man and get right to the point. Hey yo, can you speed this shit up? I wanna go to freckle bitches. You're going to die here, son. Make no mistake about that. But if it makes it any easier on you, I'll be sure to thank you in my acceptance speech. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a party to...